Okay, let's go. Okay, everyone, ready? Go. Thanks for tuning in to another episode of the lecture series. This one is entitled The Loose Goose. I'm David Ashcraft, father of four. I am inspired to give life lessons in the way of lectures to my boys on various occasions. And you can take these lectures and you can use them to help with your, fo your family as well. This one is about the loose goose. Now I have a question for the Ashcraft kids. What and why do geese fly in a V? Uh, because I he's a goose. Because he's a goose? Any other reasons? Um, so, so the one goes so to the side. One goes to the side? We have aerodynamics? The air goes to the side for less. That, that for less event, lost goose. Lost goose. Pi, any guesses? Uh, follow the leader. Follow the leader. Number one, conserve energy. And I don't know if you're like me, but I get a little worn out chasing all my kids around, and I would hope they could get in the V formation so I didn't have to expend so much energy. Number two, less resistance. I feel like my children are part of the resistance uh, <laughs> at times. I don't know if they're planning to be in these Star Wars movies, but uh, I have the resistance among us. So... They want to fly in a V. Now, in our household, kids, who is the lead goose in the V? Me. Me. Oh, mom. <laughs> it is mom. Thank you, Gus. So we have mom. Mom is much more attractive than that, but we are using <laughs> goose to represent her. We have mom. Number two, we have got dad in no, the V me. position. Number three, Gus me. is on point. Me, me. Num that is Matt. <laughs> Who else needs to be in that V? There you go. There's Cooper. There's five of the six Ashcrafts, and here's the final one. Tucker Ashcraft. And when we're all flying together, conserve energy, we have less resistance, we can get places faster, and where do we need to go today? We need to go to football. And you know what? If we get to football on time, I reward everybody, and we get to Dick's Burgers. <laughs> but we can't get there, because somebody's out of the V-formation. Who just dropped out of the V-formation? Uh, me. Tucker. Tucker just dropped out of the V-formation. <laughs> now, where did Tucker go, and why is he not in the V-formation? I'm getting this. Because he is looking for his socks and his racket, because we also have tennis later in the day. But we can't get in the truck. We can't get where we want to go because Tucker's not in the V formation. Well, here's how it works. is when one goose drops down there, two other geese have to get out of the V formation. <laughs> Kids, who are the other geese that have to go? Mac and Cooper. It is not Mac and Cooper. Oh, Mom and Dad. Another reason, if Mom and Dad have to drop out of the V formation, are we able to keep an eye on everyone? No. No. So what are you guys doing? We're uh, just playing around. Are we all going on Xbox? <laughs> that, that's right. iPad, computer. Uh huh. So all of the bad behaviors. It's and nice to see you're down. talking about those. It's Thanks for the confession. Them, on the remote. <laughs> yes. So here's the choices to get back in the V formation. Number one, the goose gets better. It gets healed mm -hmm. and it gets back. If it doesn't get better and it can't fly, they leave the goose to die. Uh oh. So it's either fly or die. Tucker, what is your choice? <laughs> I don't want to die, Dad. That's right. So find your <laughs> socks and your racket and get in the truck now. And by the way, if we can all fly in the V formation, conserve energy, less resistance, Mom and I can keep an eye on everyone, we will be able... <laughs> And if we don't have anybody acting like a jack and Nate, we're going to be able to do something. We will be able to go 70% further, and that might just be, if you guys all behave and do a nice job, we can go far enough and go to Disneyland this Ooh. year. Cooper, Yay. do you want to go to Disneyland? Yeah! Mac, Disneyland? Yeah. Gus, Disneyland? Yeah. Tucker, Disneyland? No. You're not going to have to worry about it, because I'm going to give you a lie for it. 
So there's the original picture of the loose goose when I was doing the lecture and Tucker dropped out of the V formation. <laughs> there's the T for Tucker. We ultimately we ended up going to Dick's Burgers and we did make it to Disneyland. But here you go. Right from this is where you can go see it online. You have to do a little research before you want to give a lecture series to the kiddos. To, uh, that one stuck out to me. Two other geese will fall out of our, uh, formation. Those geese's names are Scott and Dave. And they'll remain with the weakened goose or the goose who can't find his socks and racket. And they will stay and protect the injured goose from predators until it's able to fly or die. die. Thank you. Fire or die. That was the loose goose. Thank you for watching this. Join us for other lectures. If you like the video, give a thumbs up. <laughs> Subscribe. Do what you need to do. <laughs> Stay in the V formation. Or else you're